This is a clone of the Khan Academy code base. The Khan Academy code is open source, so this is our own copy. And I want to give you a tour of the admin UI for managing the content. So if you want to create your own site or change the content of the site, you would use this UI. It's restricted to just admin. Here we see the content tree and you open it up and you see the videos, you can close it again. Let's say um, we're physics first people. We believe physics should be taught before biology and chemistry. We can just rearrange it here with the drag and drop interface. So that example, uh, they just have videos in science. What does it look like when we have exercises too? Okay, so here is a drill down in a math section, and we can see the exercises here, and we can see the videos here. So right now, on the right here, we're seeing the category information for multiplication and division. And you can see we can add a, this is the topic, we can add a subtopic, add a new video, add an existing video, new exercise, existing exercise URL, delete topic, and ungroup the topic. If we go into an exercise, we can see what some of the metadata is here. So we have the position in the map. There's actually a really cool new, York, new UI that lets you do drag and drop on the map, but we'll be demoing that probably tomorrow. It's in the new code. And we can add prerequisites. Right now division uh, three is the prerequisite. What it covers. So if you've already done division, if, you've done, if you can pass this, then you're assumed to have known division three and it says what the related vis uh, videos are, descriptions, and tags. So let's go down here and look at the video for division. And you can see that basically it's just pulling it right off of YouTube. So you can already use any, add any video that is a YouTube video into this system. So as you can see, it's it's a basic UI, but it's pretty uh, it's pretty robust. You could really do a lot without any programming in terms of modifying, adjusting, and adding content if you have your own system and you have the admin privileges.